doesn't matter how much we grow up, we will always be haunted by the traumatizing moments from kids' movies. Now, I'm not even going to include Disney or Pixar because honestly, they deserve their own lists and death scenes don't count because they're more sad than traumatizing. I'm talking about the things that scarred you as a person. Things like Large Marge in Pee-wee's Big Adventure. Not only is it super creepy that she doesn't blink the entire time she tells her story, out of nowhere, we get this. <laughs> Yeah, what up, nightmares? How about Willy Wonka in the Chocolate Factory when Wonka takes us on a terrifying acid trip in the disguise of a boat ride? From the monotonous chanting to the images of chickens getting straight decapitated, this is just messed up. And speaking of messed up, Return to Oz starts with Dorothy escaping an insane asylum, essentially drowning her way back to Oz, which is now ruled by a headless witch, who chases Dorothy down a hallway of her collection of screaming severed heads. Oh, and there's these guys too. Looks like we're not in Kansas anymore, Toto. Taking this in a different direction, Stand By Me is actually rated R, but let's be real, you didn't know that, you thought it was a kid's movie too. So, the boys are swimming in a lake until they realize they are covered in leeches, solidifying forevermore our fear of bodies of water. But then Gordy reaches down and pulls a leech out of his underwear. Guys, I can't even do this. I just, I can't, I'm done. <sighs> All right, fine. Next up, Labyrinth. Next up, Beetlejuice. There's something about stop motion animation that's just creepy, but this takes it to the next level by trying to be creepy. And let's be real, at the end of the day, the most traumatic thing about Beetlejuice is Beetlejuice. So let's move on to some cartoons, shall we? Like Brave Little Toaster, a family-friendly adventure. You know, except for when that clown in a firefighter outfit lights everything on fire and whispers, Run. Or All Dogs Go to Heaven, where all the dogs go to heaven, except for that one part where they go to hell and it's terrifying. Or Fern Gully, which is just a bunch of little fairy dudes, except for the sludge monster that will always haunt your dreams. I mean, even just the plot of Secret of Nim is horrible. A widowed mother needs immediate medical care for her child dying of pneumonia and seeks the help of this guy. But you know what? None of this is nearly as bad as any of Watership Down, which somehow has a PG rating. The British Board of Film Classification decided, quote, whilst the film may move children emotionally during the film's duration, the graphic nature is not severe enough to deeply trouble them, and thus the PG rating is quite appropriate. Wait, what? That's like telling me the scene in Who Framed Roger Rabbit where Judge Doom is slowly crushed by a cement roller and reanimates as a psychopathic human cartoon hybrid, or the scene in The Witches where the kids are obscenely transformed into mice are somehow acceptable for kids. Or adults even watching this stuff? How is this okay? My goodness. Guys, what moment traumatized you the most? Let me know in the comments, and if you liked the video, share it on Facebook or Twitter, and make sure you check out more of our What to Watch videos. Until next time, you can find me on Twitter at Tim Geddes. Let Tim host.